Hi guys, welcome back to a new Rush Wars video. I've been gone for a couple days, wanted to hop back on Rush Wars. We just got a new update. I'm going to be talking about it a little bit, but Jimmy already went over it for the most part. A lot of stuff has changed, which I appreciate, and I'm going to be just doing some attacks and showing you guys some of the new Rush Wars. First off, we had a season reset a couple days ago, so I'm going to push this season. I have nothing really going on the next couple weeks, so we're just going to grind it out, try to hit an all-time best. Hopefully, I'll get up to... Well, Legendary League or Legend League, not Legendary in Rush Wars. This new layout looks super sweet. We have the attack button in the bottom right hand side. And I there's also this whole new draft feature um, for, for troops. And I want to play around with it and see what happens because I haven't, you know, I read up on it when the update dropped, but I really haven't played because I was without internet for the last couple days. But I know our hero, we now have the ch the choice to drop the hero if we want to. Yeah, we can't change him in the battle, but we can drop him or choose to keep him if we wanted to. As for what we're going to try on this base, I'm just going to send it. We'll see what happens. I'm just going to go like this, and I think I'll drop Coach at the top. I love, I love the fact that we could choose to drop Coach or not. That's really nice, or any hero. Um, we'll, we'll get a, a, a rage spell down, we'll get a med kit on my troops, and then we'll get, oh, come on, oh, dang it, are you kidding me? We just barely lost that. Okay, we should be fine, I think, yeah, we'll definitely be able to beat this player, but, you yeah, know, Boxer's super cool, and we got a, a rifleman on the bottom, so we'll be fine. The whole new draft feature, I haven't really seen it in action. I have a feeling it works just like the domination draft features, which, oh, I didn't see these two Kung Fus in the back. Oh, man, we got, we got destroyed, guys. Oh, <laughs> we were so close. I didn't realize Kung Fus versus Boxers were so strong. I also didn't r quite realize that Hot Shots, it didn't matter for that battle, but Hot Shots now only shoot ground. I think my gold mine here, okay, I don't have, I don't know what to do here. I had such bad towers. I kind of just dropped stuff. Gold mines last only 24 hours now, which is nice, but I wish it, it lasted like 26 hours. So it shifted the hour. Okay, what am I doing? Yes, upgrades first. I got some new upgrade stuff. I can upgrade my rocket traps, traps. let's go. And then I don't want to upgrade arcades right now. So we won't do that. Let's hit attack. So we get a draft. So let's see what happens. I think it's all random, just like the current random system, but it just makes it hard. Like what? It makes it a lot harder. We'll try this, but I don't know if the, the number of troops resets after every battle. It has to. Yeah, it has to reset. It definitely does. So it just limits you from taking all hot shots or something, which kind of sucks because that's meta. So I don't really know what I think, how I think about that. But I'm not going to attack that guy because he has a Gatling gun. Let's find someone without a Gatling gun. We'll attack this guy. <laughs> we'll attack him. I think we'll go from the bottom side. And I'm just going to clump up my troops like crazy. We'll drop Coach. And we'll wait for our troops to get, or his troops to get all clumped up. I just don't want to lose all my troops to these guys. So just clumping them up. Okay, I might not need to use the last couple troops I have. I think I'll be fine, but if it gets close, I will I will drop it. Maybe I shouldn't have dropped Coach. Yeah, we won't drop the the last couple towers, last couple cards. Huh. Yeah, we'll see how the draft feature plays out. I think. I mean, the defense already kind of had a draft feature where you could only drop so many defenses of a certain thing down. I don't know if it's going to be more random now or not. I know a lot of you guys might not be Rush Wars players, but I'm assuming if you made it this far, you probably are. Uh, that was a stupid thing to say. They're trying to make the game more playable. There, there's some glaring issues in the game, and they're trying to figure out how to fix that. Brawl Stars did the same thing. They had issues with the gameplay, and they spent so long trying to figure out how to go about fixing certain things. So... I'm not worried. I know that it's gonna get worked out in the end. Kind of sucks. Oh, this sucks. Oh my, my troops didn't get frozen. Okay, we're good. So they're 
trying to find a way to fix the system, which sucks. It really does that there's something the matter with the game, but honestly, it can't. Oh, are you kidding me? This is gonna be bad. I'm gonna run out of time. I'm gonna have to drop the rest of my shoes to try to take down a couple more of the pitchers before that, but. I really don't know how they can fix the game. Like, make it more fun for everyone. We're just gonna have to see what happens to the game. A lot, a lot can happen. A lot can change. Yeah, here we go. Let's get that time speed. We're gonna drop our our two tanks and our pitchers because I do not want to. And we'll also drop Coach because I want to see if Coach is gonna lose a, a life if I don't. If he doesn't get wounded at all. Let's see what happens. There we go, player is taken out. We'll see if coach goes down a life. But I, yeah, I don't know how to fix the game. Okay, good, he didn't lose a life. The cards reset after every every battle, which makes sense. I mean, it'd be stupid if it didn't. You run out of troops really fast, but they're just trying to figure out what to do. Yeah, that's, that's all it is, guys. No, 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 not good, not good, not good. Get up there, get up there, coach. Get up there, <laughs> take down that guy. Okay. So as soon as he gets wounded, there's a little health feature that blows up over his head and shows that he's wounded. So we'll get a tank down. We'll get three pitchers down. I know you get gold if you have troops alive, but there's no way one little jetpack player can take down the rest of his base him having all tanks it also seems like everyone has tanks right now which kind of sucks because i don't really like attacking tanks i mean it's not really the hardest troop to attack against it's hard when you have jetpacks let me just leave it there so let me know down below what you guys think rush wars can do to make the game maybe a little bit more playable. I, I really like the commander thing where commanders are now optional. You don't have to use a commander. And the three hearts on commanders is brilliant. It's just so much nicer to have three health. Okay, we're just gonna go from the top, go from the bottom, try to break the two on the, the sides. And then we probably won't get the one, the last one, but I mean, we can try to try to snake it, guys. Let's drop our, our, our girl up here. I think we'll, we'll be fine. Depending on what those rocket traps hit. Oh yeah, okay. Heck yeah, guys, heck yeah. Look at those tanks, beefy boys. We also got a Halloween theme in game, which is pretty cool. I think Boom Beach is gonna probably be putting out a Halloween theme. I don't know if that's a main focus of their game, putting out a Halloween theme. I don't know why it is for Rush Wars. I mean, it, it get, I guess it brings up emotions just a little bit in the game. Sucks to say, it brings up emotions for the players. Makes the game more interesting, just having a reskin of troops. Okay. Let me see. Can't really see, my finger's in the way. I think I can't hit both of those girls. But I could hit the mortar. No, I like hitting both of those girls. That sounded bad. <laughs> oh, no. Get our hero down and get jetpacks on the bottom. Hopefully the laser will come up before that. Yeah, and then the jetpacks will take down the troops on the bottom. There we go. Let's go. Perfect. All of those troops will die. That's fine. Oh, our tank is still alive down the mortar nice okay that means my jetpack so I have enough time to finish up the base for us a lot of quality of life improvements in the last update I also should look at the the troop changes because I have a feeling there's some stuff I just missed I know they boosted up they definitely boosted up chests and made unlocking stuff a lot easier I've been upgrading so much there's a thousand upgrade that's awesome and I'm getting really close to getting the next core, <laughs> the next, I, I mean, I could already get HQ8, sorry, yeah, HQ8, but I can't get the chopper, so there's no point in me buying HQ8 and dropping the same amount of troops, but paying twice as much, because I think it's gonna be 60,000, so not twice as much, but 20,000 more. 
Okay. Oh, see, this is this is the draft feature, guys. I can't just spam rocket trucks. Okay, I don't really like that. Oh, man. Oh, I don't like that at all. Okay, so the air troops really suck. The airdrops really sucks because I saw a bunch of people had two, two cost or two artillery airdrops, and if you have two of those and then one of a one airdrop cost, and you only have one of those, kind of like what my my uh, paratrooper is here because it sucks because i could bring one of a tier one or one of a tier two which defeats the purpose i don't think there should be a draft limit for airdrops like the troops is okay i can i can deal with it but for the air airdrops air troops just i feel like it's kind of cheating the system a little bit i don't know okay bear got bearman got a buff so let's use some bearman uh, what should I bring? We'll bring a ninja to take down some stuff in the back, and then we'll just spam those guys. I guess we'll spam. We'll try out a fridge. The fridge is fun. I like the fridge, but yeah, this update, it's it's good. It's stuff the game needed, but some of this stuff makes the game just a little bit worse. Okay, bear man. Oh shoot, I'm, I'm not gonna. Little guys down. <laughs> okay, there we go. Uh, bear man, let's go. Let's get in there, man. I really like the animation to drop him. That's cool. Get our ninja down. Okay, bear man. He has a lot more HP. I, I know they buffed his HP. I think they buffed his super also. Okay, let's get a freeze down. I don't want to lose all my my ground troopers. Because that would suck. Losing all my ground troopers. I think they also brought the troopers down to three. A three squad instead of a four squad. Yeah. Yeah, so there's one less now. I wonder if they changed the preview. Yeah, they did. So there's one less trooper in battles. Which, I don't know. They know how to, they know how to balance stuff out. I can't complain about balancing changes. I'm liking this. I could get down to this. It feels a little bit worse than before, but I think it's just something you have to get used to. I mean, before a lot of people hated the drafting feature, but honestly, you just had to wait it out, I feel like. And it got a lot better. It's not as bad as everyone makes it out to be. Let's get our ninja down. That tank's gonna move, and it'll be nice just to, to take... I don't know why I froze the tank. Uh, so stupid. Bearman, let's go. What? I dropped Bearman at the top. No, no. Okay. What is Bearman doing? That's what I want to know. Let's go. Bearman, attack. <laughs> Got destroyed. Oh my gosh. I definitely did not attack that base right. It's okay, though. <laughs> we got a chest. No more I can get. That's okay. Let's even go home, and then let's bring different troops. I like the rocket truck. You know, I like the troops I had. Maybe I'll bring, maybe I won't bring ninjas and instead I'll bring a gorilla. And then the freeze. No, no, let's not bring freeze. Let's bring, let's just bring more troopers. No, I can't. Okay, we'll, we'll bring a ninja. I'm gonna use the ninja differently. We'll bring one paratrooper, one medkit also. Medkit to heal up my troopers. Paratrooper to take down something in the back, hopefully. Ninja to take down some defensive unit or wound a building a lot. I don't know. I'm not gonna attack. Oh, it's so easy. We'll, we'll attack it. It's a really easy base. Ooh, I didn't see the two troopers in the bottom. Maybe, maybe no brain. Maybe it was just a storm. Oh, I don't know why I'm dropping my troops at the top. Oh, oof, oof, oof. Oh, and it one shots. Oh, okay. This. Let's just get her. Take down the bottom core at least. I'll drop ninjas to take down the bottom core. Are you gonna freeze? Please don't freeze yourself. Oh, ooh, that was close. Okay. Yeah, <laughs> medkit's not gonna do anything, but there we go. Two out of three. Not bad. Not bad. We'll go one more. I think Bear Man's dead. Yeah. We'll go one more. We'll bring. Lady Grenade, I think is her name. 
this will be the last one of the new update let me know down below how you guys are liking this update did you like it more before do you like it more now is it more fun now i don't know why it would be more fun now i think the fun level went down for me but i think what they did made sense i don't know what i said made sense but just what i'm picking up guys here we go boys med kits down get a paratrooper at the back it's not gonna be able to take oh did we we were so close to that back core that's insane can we get a no probably not dang it we were really close i didn't realize paratroopers did so much damage i feel like they buffed it or something or brought down the hp of the back gold mine because they've been crushing that thing I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Let me know down below what you guys think about this new update. Bad, good, somewhat in the middle. Um, I'm excited to see what you guys say, and I'll talk to you guys next time. Boom Beach video tomorrow, so get hyped for that. See you guys. Bye.